specific be specific imagine all the details but it actually doesn't work for everyone hello my beautiful manifestators welcome back to my channel in my channel i'm talking as a beginner manifestator to beginner manifestators like you and i'm sharing as i learn and i'm sharing all the ups and downs of my manifestation journey what went wrong what went right and how you are gonna learn on my mistakes so that you manifest exactly what you want because recently i've came across the pattern that i had that my wishes, they manifest, but not in exactly in a way that I wanted them to manifest. So for example, I really wanted to, I applied for this trainer job for a small project and I really wanted to do it. And I actually got it as I, I've written, I've scripted about it. Like I want to get this trainer position and stuff, but then they canceled it. So technically my manifestation came true, but not in a way that I wanted it to come true. That is why I was super frustrated. I was upset. I was looking for a way so that my manifestation will come true in a way I wanted it. And I've been recently listening to the podcast by Manifestation Babe, and it's a great, great podcast. I recommend it to everyone who is starting their manifestation journeys and she always gives me the answers, the exact answers that I need right now. So I had a question in my mind, like why my manifestation is not coming true as I want it to come. And during one of the episodes, she's like, there are two types of manifestators, the specific ones and the non-specific ones. So for example, when you are manifesting your dream house, a specific manifestator, uh, she is imagining exactly what are the colors of the rugs, uh, what kind of sofa she wants to have, what will be the plants that she wants to have in her house, how it will look, the colors, the fabrics, every, every thing in the small details, like knobs on the doors, all of that stuff. And it makes this type of people, the specific manifestators, to feel good. Because the more they go into the details, the better they feel about their visualization or manifestation. So there is also other type of manifestators like me uh, who are going crazy and frustrated when they have to think about all the details. And everyone in the manifestation world, everyone tells you like, be specific, be specific, imagine all the details, but it actually doesn't work for everyone, apparently not for me and maybe not for you. If you're looking in this video and if you're searching for a way how to make sure that your manifestation will come true in a way that you want it. So instead of visualizing the image, instead of visualizing and trying to think of all the details, I am now focused on the feelings. So instead of thinking like, I want this job, I want this job, I want this job, I'm focusing on how I will feel when I will get this job so that if I feel good, then it means that everything will go smoothly and I'll get, get this job and it won't be canceled and everything will happen for the best for me. So you need to try both types of manifestations and first try out the detailed one, try out to visualize everything and have this image of your perfect house or like of your perfect life, of your perfect day, of your perfect shopping experience or like of your perfect bag or everything like that. But if you don't feel like it, if you feel that this makes you frustrated, it's okay because it means that you're like me and you need to focus on the feelings. Okay, when I'm thinking of the perfect day, what I want to feel during the day. It doesn't matter what I will do. It doesn't matter how much I'll earn. It doesn't matter who will be together with me, whether I'll be alone or with someone, with my family or stuff, doesn't matter. How I want to feel, focus on the feeling. Because recently I had my perfect day that I didn't manifest, I didn't visualize it. I just set an intention and said, okay, I just want this day to be like the best day of my life. And it was. I got my coffee in the morning, even if I didn't ask it, my friend gave it to me like for free. Then we went to mountains, then we were driving in these beautiful places, we saw the lake, we ate good food, we had like good and deep conversations with my friends, having all these good memories about our school and stuff. And the weather was perfect. And the most important thing is that I felt so good. So I was just focusing on the feelings and this 
ideal like perfect day happened in my reality so if you were wondering how to manifest and if you were wondering why some of your manifestations and wishes they just don't come true as you wanted them to come true and something's wrong it's not like the part of the picture okay i got this house but i wanted this to be bigger or like i wanted this to be in the certain area but i have to think about all these things all these details all these small pieces of my manifestations and that if that makes you frustrated then just give it up don't think about your visualization don't have any image just focus on the feelings ask yourself okay i want to have this home what it will feel like to live in the home and it will just fall in your lap you don't know how maybe your friend will tell you hey here is a great apartment do you want to check it out and you're like wow i had this feeling when i was visualizing when i was thinking about my home and and now this is my perfect home or like anything any visualization that you have any manifestation that you have so if you like this video please subscribe to my channel don't forget to share it with your friends and uh, i'll be talking during my next video about judging how i stopped judging people how it made me feel so much relieved and so much happier and how it also helped me to propel my manifestations and make my investigations even like faster and easier. And thank you for watching this video. I really appreciate it. And if you liked it, please make sure that you share it with everyone.